I was impressed with my visit to your franchise today. Well, sir, I believe in running a tight ship. Well, I would think that was really impressive about it. Excuse me, sir. Windows were... Um, I was told to come see you. I noticed you're on Pop One at time. I have um four years of experience as a short order cook. Oh, it's a good for a start. But you see, at Fast Freddy's, we're looking for more than just experience. We're looking for someone with initiative, someone with really good leadership skills, someone who has great customer skills. Someone who doesn't mind working a little extra hard. Mars, do you think you can fit that criteria? Yeah, sure. How much is the pay? Uh, slightly under minimum wage. No thanks. Can you believe these kids? Yeah, these are what I call generation lazy bones. You know, I wasn't like this when I was a kid. Indeed. Kids of today need more motivation. Yeah, that, that's, that's right. I totally agree with you. They want to get spoon-fed and get awarded for sleeping on their jobs. You see, that's just not how it works. Bunch of pay me, pay me, give me, give me, spoiled brats. Oh yeah, I, I, I totally agree with you. They're just a bunch of uh, selfish, egotistical and brats with no motivation at all. Nothing. They have no motivation. Yeah. Sometimes I wish we could just replace them with robots or something. Yep. And, and, and they're supposed to be the leaders of tomorrow. The leaders of tomorrow. <laughs> Alright, uh, I better get going. I actually have a new, uh, new employee coming in today and I'm really excited about him. He has a great attitude. Alright, then I have an interview at the office with some franchise. Well, I'll call you later. Alright, see you later. <laughs> Stop eating! Frankie, why aren't you wearing your headset? Uh, it's broken, sir. Doesn't matter. Policy. We have a meeting right now. What? I said, we have a staff meeting. What? We have a staff meeting right now. Ew. <clears throat> what do you want? Is a uh, staff meeting. Then. I'll be there in a minute. Okay everyone, so, as you can see, we've got a new worker here with us today. His name is Julio. Hi, I'm really looking forward to working with you all. I want every single one of you to teach him everything that he needs to know to work here, okay? Is that clear? What? And I also want to remind all of you to wear your headsets while you're working, okay? That's a policy. Is that clear? Yes. Okay. What? So when I get my math exam back, I was like, whoa, 46? Can't get no 46? I studied for this math test. I gotta get a 50. Gotta pass. So I go to my math teacher, and he's like, oh no, you gotta get a 46. This is worth 46. <coughs> I'm like, no. Nah. Uh, you can't get no 46 <coughs> for this. Oh, hold on, Mary. All right, Julio. So this is Aisha, and she's gonna teach you every single thing that you need to know about how to order stuff and how to use the cashier, okay? And if you've got any questions, you can just come to my office. So, uh, good luck. And also, can you also wear your uh, headphones work policy? Thank you. Oh, I'll just stand here and watch then. So yeah, where was I? Oh yeah, I was like, no, uh, you can't give me no 46. And he was like, yeah, I can. And I Aisha. was like, no way. I'm never getting Aisha. that kind of mark, right? Exactly, that's what I said. And then I got pissed off and I left the room. And then he was like, yeah, uh, sure, you have a customer. whatever. Oh, hold on, Mary. Someone's bothering me. What? 
Uh, do you have salad? Do you see any salad on the menu? No. Exactly. Now could you hurry up? You're holding up the line. Uh, can I have a combo one, a uh, whooping chicken burger, and can you please upsize the drink? And can I have it all to go, please? So that's your order? All right. Frankie! A combo one and a whooping chicken burger. What? Combo one and a whooping chicken burger. What? Combo one and a whooping chicken burger. With or without tomatoes? Did I say nothing about tomatoes? So no tomatoes then? Yes! Yes with tomatoes or yes without tomatoes? Yes with tomatoes! I thought you didn't want tomatoes on it. Just put the tomatoes! Oh, okay. Actually, can I have it without tomatoes? You know, Philip, I was really impressed with my visit to your franchise last week. Well, we take pride in our service, sir. You know, and I've also been looking at your records uh, and it shows that you hadn't had a single complaint for the past five years. Well, I do my best to run a tight ship, sir. And you know that we're also looking for a regional manager, and I think you might be the guy we're looking for. Well, it will be an honor for me, sir. We'll stay in contact with you in the future to let you know. All right, thank you, sir. Thanks a lot. Bye. Okay, goodbye. Come on in. Come on in, Julio. Have a seat. So, uh, what's up? Um, how are you doing on the uh, cash register? You know, Aisha is the best there is. And uh, do you think you can handle it? Well, Mr. Phillips, that's what I came, came to talk to you about. Um, Aisha may know her stuff, but I think we can really improve how things are done. What do you mean? We never had a complaint before. No, you can't talk to the manager, because either you talk to me or you get out. Well, I think the customers will feel more comfortable if they're greeted when they come in the door. Like, you know, welcome to First Freddy's or something. And we gotta use the monitor, then the cashier and the cook doesn't have to yell back and forth. Well, unfortunately, Julio, the uh, monitors are not working, they're broken. That's just it, Mr. Phillips. I have electronics background and I can fix it. Great idea. Thanks, Mr. Phillips. Should I get started on the monitor? But before you do that, why don't you go and learn how to use the griller from Frankie? Okay, Mr. Phillips. All right, see you later. So this is the griller, huh? Hmm? What? I came to learn the grill. Oh, really? You came here to learn the grill? Okay, yeah. first, grab onto the grill. Okay. Uh, here are your pointed headsets. I thought they don't work. Well, they don't. It's company policy, though. Okay. So, just put them on, and uh, I shall be going. Oh, wait. I don't know what to do. Well, everything's all self-explanatory. There's no salad! Can't you read? Uh, why can't we have salad? Company policy. Why else? Oh, okay. All right, I'll be going now. See ya. Come on in. Hey, Julio, how's it going? Did you learn how to use the gorilla from Frankie? Well, I think I got the hang of it. Awesome. There's just one thing. Uh, we need salad on the menu. A lot of customers ask for it, and I'm a really good chef. I can put some new recipes in that the customers would like. <sighs> Unfortunately, I can't do that because it's part of the standard and it has to be the same in every single franchise. But this sounds like a very good idea, so what I can do, I can actually bring this up in the uh, regional director's meeting and hopefully they'll think about it and we might include them in the uh, menu. But for now, it has to be like this. But for now, why don't you go and uh, learn how to use the mouth from Omar? No problem, Mr. Phillips. Hello? 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 Oh, uh, you're the new guy, right? Yeah, I'm Julio. Julio or something, right? Yeah. Uh, well, what I want you to do right now is you just take this and I'll be on break for a good seven hours. Bye! Uh, what do I do with this? Uh, well, you just mop, really. I. I guess, so, um, well, bye. Come on in. Hey. So, did you clean all the floors and did you learn how to use the mop? Mr. Phillips, I've mopped the floor 
couple of times and we don't have that much customers coming in to keep on mopping the floor. And while we're waiting for that to dry, should I do the windows? They look awfully dirty. Well, okay. Here's the thing, Julio. Every store that we have in our franchise has, uh, has a cleaning union and part of their job is to clean the windows. And we cannot give uh, their job to someone else. So, you know, I hope you understand that. All right, Julio, so um, you finished all of your shifts for today, and are you now familiar with the, uh, working, uh, with the work environment here? I think I get it now. I can handle it. So, um, you know that your next shift is uh, tomorrow, so we'll see you tomorrow. Hey Julio, why aren't you wearing your headphones? How many times do I have to tell you guys to wear the headphones? It's a policy. It doesn't work. It's a policy, I said. You're supposed to wear it even though they don't work. Okay. Okay, we have a staff meeting. What? We have a staff meeting. We have a staff meeting. All right. In two minutes. All right. All right, everyone, so listen up. As you can see, we've got a new member in our staff today. His name is Ryan. Um, can you introduce yourself to him? Well, thank you, sir. My name is Ryan, and uh, I'm the new guy, so I, I don't have the company headphones yet, but I have a lot of great customer service skills, and I'm an excellent cook. 